A new dramatic video of a moment of the landslide that took out a part of the historic Casa Romantica Culture Center in San Clemente. It's on the bluff above the San Clemente Pier. The hillside there just came crashing down with some debris even hitting the railroad tracks at the bottom, stalling service out. KCAS Lori Perez is live in San Clemente with the very latest. And Lori, a lot of disruption there, especially with weddings at the Casa. Ross, that's right, with weddings and other events planned at the Casa, but also with nearby residences and, of course, the all-important railroad corridor that runs along here. Today, city and county lawmakers joined Congressman Mike Levin to view the damage here as they work together to try to address the recurring problem. Watch out, big one coming down now, guys. Watch as the slope below Casa Romantica in San Clemente turns into an avalanche of brush and dirt. The long, strong slide taking with it so much earth, the oceanfront patio above it followed it down, causing severe damage. The cultural center has now been red tagged. We're looking at a disaster here. Along with city and county leaders, Congressman Mike Levin was on site Saturday to see it with his own eyes. And that would be my hope that we can get the, the experts in here to make sure that we understand what's happening and to prevent uh, anything worse from happening. The hillside dropped about 20 feet Thursday after weeks of incremental movement that was already being monitored by scientists and city leaders. Events at Casa have now been canceled for the foreseeable future. Residents in the condos next door have evacuated and service on the shoreline tracks is stopped because of debris. That means no Metrolink or Amtrak. Local leaders are working on busing alternatives for now, but again, I'm relocating the rails altogether for the future. This is the third time in two years that our railroad tracks have been shut down. From an economic standpoint, roughly a billion dollars a year in economic impact on our region. So when the rail corridor is shut down, even for a week, a month, we're talking about tens or even hundreds of millions of dollars in regional economic impact. They're working on county, state, and federal disaster declarations to clear funding to address the tracks, the erosion, and Casa Romantica, perhaps as a federally recognized historic site. It is super sad. It's a landmark in St. Clemente. But it won't likely help Kristen Orr and Steve Roseman, who are set to be married on July 2nd. The landmark event center is, at best, temporarily closed. Symbolizes just absolute beauty and the beauty of San Clemente and, and the California coastline. And, and so it's pretty heartbreaking, but you know, look, it's getting married that counts, not always just the location, but. And through this fence here, you can see just how close the railroad tracks are to where the slide ended up at the bottom of the hill there. Now, this is just the latest landslide in the area. Local leaders say the slides and coastal erosion are a continuing problem and risk for homes, for people, and again, for those train tracks. We're live in San Clemente. I'm Lori Perez. Back to you. All right. Thanks a lot, Lori.